Today, we'd like to talk to you about capelin. First question, what are capelin? Well, they're fish. A really teeny, tiny fish. But they have a big impact. Capelin are forage fish, which means they're an essential food source for lots of other species, like Atlantic cod, seals, seabirds, and whales. The more we know about the health of capelin stocks in our oceans, the more we can learn about the future of the larger marine ecosystem. So we have a tiny fish with huge implications. The trouble is we don't know much about what influences capelin behavior. And that's where you come in. WWF Canada has partnered with the St. Lawrence Global Observatory to create eCapelin, a citizen science tool for the Capelin Observer Network. Here's how it works. All along the St. Lawrence and across the Atlantic provinces, capelin come to shore in large numbers to spawn between April and July. It's a process referred to as capelin rolling, and when you see it, you'll understand why. If you see capelin rolling in these areas at this time of year, log on to the eCapelin website, submit a photo, and provide the date, time, and location of your observation. Congratulations! You've just become a citizen scientist contributing important data to the health of our oceans. Recording these observations can help us answer important questions like how many capelin spawning sites are there across the Atlantic? How do these sites change year to year? And what influences their abundance or decline? Determining that can help guide our conservation efforts to protect critical capelin habitat. So remember, if you see capelin rolling, observe and report. It's a small action with big implications for the health of our marine ecosystem.